Have you ever seen a car crash? You know, something like a truck that slammed into the side of a Prius or something, and you know it's gonna be bad, but you wanna look at it anyways? Yeah, that's what this YouTuber is like. This is Nikocado Avocado. Jesus, where do I begin with this guy? Uh, let's start light. So with mukbang YouTubers, they'll usually put a, a picture of whatever they're eating in the thumbnail, like Taco Bell or Papa John's or something like that. But Nick, Nick is a little different. He likes to get these macro shots of him with the food in his mouth, like sticking out. And he's got that big trail there, usually of like noodles or cheese, and just have this nasty, disgusting shot. It makes him look like a three-year-old who's being fed by his mom. All right, it's, it's freaking gross and he does it every single time. If he's not slurping his food in his thumbnail, he's usually crying in his thumbnail. Sometimes it's both. We'll get onto that in a minute. Now when Nick eats in his videos, he doesn't just have a nice little meal like grilled chicken or whatever, you know, he likes to go all out. Stuffing my face with five pounds of cheesy goodness. Wingstop challenge, 5,000 calorie fried chicken feast. Onion rings challenge, 5,000 calorie Burger King. 10,000 calorie avocado challenge. Now obviously eating a 3,000 calorie meal every few days isn't the most healthy thing, right Nick? What is this? And this unhealthiness comes through a lot in his crying videos. Yeah, this guy has made like dozens of videos of him just turning on the camera, freaking crying about his life to God and everybody, and he uploads it. He actually uploads that stuff. It's insane to me. Look at this. I can't deal with this. My life is crashing down. This one just says dot. This is just dot. That's the, that's the title is dot. 22 minutes, dot. This one's dot dot, not for kids. And then this one where he looks like he's choking to death, this was originally called dot dot dot. I remember, I remember seeing it, Nick. You can't just, why'd you upset the trilogy? Why'd you change the title? Uh, apparently he's got a lot of shit going down in his life, but you don't have to cry about it on camera. You're married. Why don't you talk to your husband? or your parents, or anyone, literally anyone else. Hold on, can we talk about his crying face really quick? Look at this guy. It looks like he got stung in the face by a bunch of bees. It looks like he got smacked in the face by a horde of fifth graders. Ouch, my heart came out of the socket. Ouch, 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 ouch. Hey, Sriracha, if this guy's in such a bad place, why are you shooting on him? I'll tell you why, because this guy loves attention. He loves making those crying videos so that he'll get all the positive comments saying, Oh Nick, you're such a nice guy, Nick. Please don't stop making videos. I love you, Nick. Ooh. He knows that he's a car wreck. He knows that people can't look away. That's why he does this. Look, let me show you. His newest video, he put it out yesterday, I think. Why I'm quitting YouTube and deleting my entire channel. Just look, just look at the beginning of this video where he says he's deleting his channel and everything. Just watch the first like 30 seconds. I'm done. I'm done. Get the f out of here. Look at him throwing Cheetos at the camera like a child. Eat my Cheeto. Eat my Cheeto. Look at him smelling his shoe and saying that it smells like cheese. Was it even called? Do I smell like cheese? No. Mozzarella from yesterday. <laughs> How can someone record this? Have the file out, sync the audio and everything, sit down to edit it and not think, hey, this makes me look like a piece of sh**, but if I upload it, everyone will feel sorry for me and they'll have to watch it. That's what he was thinking all along. And besides him throwing Cheetos and being entertaining for the camera in this video, it's exactly 10 minutes. Wow, would you look at that? It's the perfect amount of time for some mid-roll ads. Wow, that's, that's really convenient, right Nick? Does he have any mid-rolls at all? Where did he put them? Well, he has them in the first like three minutes. There's two mid-rolls in like the first three minutes of the video. Guys, I'm so sad, my life is crashing down. But can you watch this 30 second ad for me before you see why I'm crying again? And this isn't the first time he's ever made a pity party for himself either. There's plenty of these videos. Look at this one he uploaded about a month ago. It, it starts with a sad montage of him making noodles. I'm not kidding. What 
What kind of person who's genuinely in a bad place will make a sad montage of them making noodles? That's not something you do. This guy loves having people worry about him. He's fake. He loves crying on camera and, and venting all of his personal laundry out in the air so he can have all the little kids come say, Oh, that sucks. That sucks, Nick. Oh, I'm so sorry for you. Oh, that sucks. You know, with this new video saying that he'll like delete his channel or whatever, he's not going to do that. I, I bet you, I bet you, man, that he's not going to delete his channel. He's going to make a video in a week and say, Oh, guys, I love all the support you gave me. Thank you for all the support all the kind comments thank you okay I think that's it for me um bye <laughs>